continue our tour through the western suburbs as we search for Chicago's best warm sandwich. Jeff wrote in and said we had to try out Saw Millie Sandwich Shop in Riverside, where the menu is creative and the space is nice and cozy. Let's go. Why do you think a local community sandwich shop is so important to the neighborhood? There are people that want to eat lunch and have good quality food. <laughs> We take food seriously. We make everything from scratch. We roast our turkeys. We smoke our briskets. We do pulled fresh uh, pork shoulder. That just tastes better than what you normally end up in a fast food sandwich. So we come at least once, maybe sometimes twice a week, and then it's warm. They take care of you. They're friendly. I like that it's a fresh sandwich every day, not pre-made. You can get your food in just a few minutes, so you don't have to wait around. They make it right here, so you get it nice and warm. You see the ingredients that go into it, and we love it. Two turkeys, no avocado on you guys have a bunch of really good choices here. What are we making today? The pork roast dip sandwich. That sounds absolutely delicious. It's pulled pork shoulder that's been cooked overnight, a chimichurri sauce, and then it's served with a homemade au jus on the side for dipping. They don't do fast food like that where I'm from. I'm excited to try it. <laughs> hey, Victor. Hey, Lauren, how are you? I'm doing good. Now, I heard you guys make everything from scratch here. Of course. And one of the amazing things you guys also make is chimichurri. Oh, yeah. For a pork sandwich, you want to start over here. So let's add our mint over here. A little bit more, a little bit more. Dump the whole thing in there? Yeah, you should do that. Oh, okay. That's, that's right. easier. You could have just said that to me, Victor. <laughs> Cilantro? Cilantro? Uh, I think it's this one. <laughs> Wrong. All right, cool. <laughs> parsley next? I know which one's parsley. Ah, uh, that's the only one we have there. <laughs> Roasted garlic. Oh my gosh, that smells so That's good. That's what I say, right? We need smell a vision in here because <laughs> this is great. The other way? I know what I'm doing. It's uh -huh. fine. You're doing it wrong again. Don't! What are you saying? Yeah, what other way? Show you? <laughs> All right. <laughs> so way? put it like this. We turn it. There we go. And that's how we make chimichurri. Oh, the mint really comes through. That's and the roasted so garlic good. does. You gotta make some sandwiches, you want to? Yeah, how about we see which one of us can make the best All one? All right, let's make a challenge. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> Two pieces of provolone. My favorite cheese. Wait for the bread to toast. Add some of this garlic de jeunesse on the bottom. Baby kale. I'm like dropping kale into all the other ingredients. The pork as you. Get to that chimichurri, the good stuff. Ah, uh, just look, look at that. that. Oh, yeah. Uh, Can we do a quick comparison? Look at that. Me or Victor? I think it's me. I told you. <laughs> the traitor. Victor put me through sandwich making boot camp. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Give it a big dunk. That meat is so tender. It's eight hours roasted. You can taste every hour. The chimichurri <laughs> is amazing. I get the garlic aioli, the zing of the chimichurri, mm -hmm. the richness of the pork, and then when you dip it in the au jus, which just kind of blends it all together. Me and Victor had a little bit of a competition. We'll to see, see which one you think is best. I'm voting you made this one. Oh, wait, but which one do you think is best? <laughs> the one <Man>. you made. <laughs> yes. Look guys, if you're looking for a hot sandwich, this is one of the best I've ever had. The proof is in the au jus. That's Riverside. I'll see you guys later. Thank <laughs> you.